What's up, ladies and gentlemen of YouTube, Boogie2988 coming at you live once again through the power of the internet. And as you guys know, tomorrow is E3 day. Um, all of the big companies are going to be broadcasting all of their information via Twitch. Other ways, uh, Spike TV is covering it as well. Um, and you can see a good amount of all this information as we get it. Now, not everybody's able to watch it live, um, but I will be watching it live and I'll be uh, regurgitating it via Twitter. Um, here a little bit here on YouTube and a little bit via Twitch. So here's what I'm going to ask you to do. I'm going to post all that social media information down here below. And if you follow me on any of the sources, you'll be able to get um, the news and the articles and everything else as it comes out. You'll be able to get the links to stuff. You'll be able to get links to uh, when I go live on Twitch to talk about what we just saw. You'll be able to see the YouTube videos that I create based on that information. And all of that will be there. So just follow those links down below. And uh, that said... Uh, it's an exciting day. I'm looking forward to some big, big stuff. Uh, personally, my wish list is a release date for Project Morpheus from Sony. Um, absolutely my number one thing from them. I'm looking for release dates for Smash, and I'm hoping it's really, really soon for Super Smash Brothers. Um, both Wii U, obviously it's not coming out to winter, but I, I would love to know what the release date's there. Um, there's also a rumor that there is a Mario Maker game from Nintendo uh, that allows you to use the Wii U to make uh, Mario-style uh, levels that you can upload and share with your friends via the, the Wii U's network, networking system. That would be amazing. I'm looking forward to some actual gameplay from a Zelda game. I am looking forward to whatever Microsoft has in store, and Phil Spencer is talking about some big, big stuff. I, I'm sure there's going to be some Halo-related stuff. Halo has never fully tickled my fans. Um, but I'm really looking forward to Microsoft's big announcements as well, as well as all the smaller announcements from all the different gaming companies. Um, and then the one that I'm really concerned about, one that I'm really excited about, is that during Sony's conference, Valve is going to be announcing a feature, and that could be anything, but what I'm hoping it's going to be, what I'm predicting it's going to be, um, they have been working on in-home streaming uh, for um, PC to PC, um, I would really hope that the PlayStation 4 is going to allow us to stream our PC games. If that would happen, I would be so happy. There's a huge contradiction there. It's really unlikely to happen that Sony's going to let Valve stream the games you buy on, on Steam to your PlayStation 4. But if that happened, it's probably going to be something lame. But if that happened, that's my big E3 wish. Oh, E3 Santa Claus. Jeff Keighley, please bring me that. That'd be awesome. All right. Uh, follow those links below. Follow me tomorrow. We'll talk about this stuff together. I look forward to seeing your reactions, and I hope you look forward to seeing mine. Oh, and I, I can't wait to make my first Francis video tomorrow. It's going to be a lot of videos tomorrow. The point that I'm making is probably going to be a lot of videos tomorrow, three or four, I don't know, throughout the week. It's, uh, oh, E3. It's like Gamer Christmas, only with a lot of lies built in. Close enough.